welcome to the weekend. Like James Brown, I feel good. No, 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 no. Hey, it's Saturday night, part two of your first weekend in October. Is it the first weekend in October? Might be the second, doesn't matter. I almost said anyway. I, I realized looking at my videos, I say anyway way too much. So I'm going to try not to fill the silence with something like anyway or anyhow or nonetheless. I'm just going to be silent let you enjoy the, the sounds of silence. Man, I went to the gym feeling really good, and I found the secret. I found the secret, the holy grail of energy for the gym. Now, let me tell you, you don't have to take a pill. You don't have to make a shake. All you have to do is go by Austin's birthday party, get you a big old slice of chocolate cake. I'm getting really close there. And then follow that down with a red Solo cup full of Coca-Cola. Dude. You will run on the treadmill and the elliptical as long as you want. Anyway, I got I, I said it. I said it, didn't I? I got to run in here and get something for supper. Be back shortly. So, yeah, man, that uh, chocolate cake and Coca-Cola from a red Solo cup. Kind of like James Brown said again, you know, living in America, whoa, knocks you out. Tell you what, that's some strong stuff. Speaking of living in America, I'm proud to be an American where I can go to, to the gym, you know, I go to Planet Fitness and some of y'all say, well, that's not a real gym. You know what? I still go and I sweat. Yeah, it's, you know, maybe maybe I can't go over and bench press 800 pounds, but then again, I can't bench press 800 pounds at a real gym. So there you go. So let's talk about stuff at the gym. You know, living in America, we have the freedom to stink, but that don't mean you should stink. I'm telling you what, you know, maybe instead of running on the treadmill, and feeling your heart rate with your fingers on your wrist, I mean, on yeah, on your neck, and see if it syncs with the heart rate monitor that's on your chest or on your wrist, maybe you should run up to the Dollar Tree and get some deodorant. That's right, for one dollar, you can get a stick of deodorant, and for another dollar, you can get a bottle of water. Trust me, at the gym, you need both. It's okay to come in there and not sting, okay? Just because you're more of a man than I am, I can see that if you're over there lifting 800 pounds. I don't need to smell it. I can see it. I wear my glasses, but I can see if somebody's lifting 800 pounds, they're more of a man than I am. Ladies, same thing, okay? You can get on the treadmill or on the elliptical and run 26.2 miles, and I'm proud of you. Knock yourself out. Just don't knock me out with the stuff coming from under your arms. Oh my goodness. Same thing for you, you know, you can get some of that pink deodorant for a dollar and a big old bottle of Aquafina for a dollar. And for two dollars, you can go to the gym and be hydrated well and not smell bad. Just saying, a little public service announcement there. So uh, yeah, I did a, did a 30 minutes on the elliptical machine. Kind of like it thing. I, I started, I hated it at first, but it's time to grow on me a little bit. And, uh, and then I went over and did 30 minutes on the uh, the treadmill you thought I was gonna say anyway didn't you I didn't say it so yeah I got me some uh, some dinner I'm good to go go to work here I'm hoping I don't crash after that chocolate cake and coca-cola but if it does hey Austin mama call you up I know there's got to be some left so if I call you about two o'clock in the morning just uh, jump on the helicopter and I'll give you coordinates to the landing pad and I'll just meet you out there y'all have a good weekend be safe I'm not crying. That's still sweat from that fake gym that I go to. See y'all. Bye.